G'day, it's Dave Miller from Eco Wise Homes here. So I've got a bit of a different video today. Uh, I'm going to talk about our <coughs> waste management, but um, our waste management here at home. So um, here I'll flip the camera around. So yeah, this is home for me. Um, tucked away here on 10 acres, a good little spot. Um, so all of our food scraps, like organic matter and that, we um, have this worm bath that, um, you know, we have a bucket inside the house. Um, for the food scraps and that and then this goes in here sort of whenever that bucket's full and um, in here we've got um, worms on top and then underneath all the so the food scraps and worms which I'll you know, turn away if you're squirmish but it's pretty uh, pretty gross in there all the food scraps go in there we've got the um, horse manure underneath under here and then every day we tip a bucket of fresh water in the top here it trickles, trickles down into this bucket, so you get some nice um, worm tea down there. And then we've got the fruit orchard at the bottom here, which then we um, yeah to just scatter the uh, the um, worm tea around there. And then um, this is my little bit of a very basic permaculture sort of setup. Now, forgive me, I'm a builder, I'm not uh, I don't specialise in permaculture, but so we have six bays that uh, the chooks go into. Uh, for about five weeks. So you can see here the chooks have been in here um, I think about a week and then uh, next month they will go to here and then the following so next five weeks I go there following five weeks and so forth. So I only planted in here um, yesterday and then this bay here I planted in uh, a month ago or five weeks ago and then another bay down here and so forth. Um, in here is a um, sort of bit of a permanent sort of bed so we have some strawberries and um, herbs and that and the same down the other end and each bay here we sort of plant just like an annual sort of summer or winter um, sort of uh, patch on that too so the sort of the, the the bays at the back where the chooks go in obviously the chook when we feed the chooks and that they uh, do their business and that sort of fertilizes those bays now so we don't need to worry about adding any uh, feed for them um, then these bays here as I was saying we put horse manure in that bath so every six months or so we empty that bath out so it's not zooming and then just scatter the um, horse manure around on here and um, yeah that's sort of how we try to um, manage our waste so yeah guys i don't know what you thought of that video but um i just thought i'd do a bit different if you did like it please let me know if you don't uh, yeah, let me know too um but yeah i just thought i'd let you know how we sort of um manage our waste and also uh, try and feed ourselves